Are you a sea kayaker with a pretty good roll, at least in calm water? Does your roll ever fail when you get dumped in rough water? And if you do get pushed back in, do you have to set up for another roll? What if I told you that failing a roll doesn't mean you have to end up upside down setting up for another try? Knowing full well is just as likely to fail. I'm Paulo, and this is Dancing with the Sea. It's for those of us who want more ease and finesse, and less feeling like it's hard and I don't feel safe. The kayak is not a tool to help you conquer. It's to show us that we belong to nature. In this video, I'm going to share with you the secret to rolling a sea kayak in waves and how you can keep your head above water even in the roughest of conditions. So sit back, relax, and get ready to learn the skills that will take your kayaking to the next level. Having a good, solid roll that works in rough conditions can actually expand your paddling range, allowing you to visit those remote locations and keep yourself much safer. Here's a common problem I see, and there's a good reason why people do this. It works. It's deceivingly easy, at least in calm water. Can you see why it, this puts you in a vulnerable position when rolling in rough water? Let's play it in slow motion. Can you see it now? Right here. What if a wave was to push you back over at this exact moment? When it comes to rolling a sea kayak in waves, the key is to avoid laying on the back deck too early. What you want to do instead is keep your back flat on the water. Keep rotating the kayak until it's almost upright. Notice there's no vulnerable position anymore. When you don't stay rotated with your back on the water for as long as possible, you can more easily get pushed back on the water. What you want to do instead is stay rotated with your back flat on the water for as long as you can. If a wave pushes you over at any point, you're still on the surface, you're still breathing. You can relax. And there's something else going on. You're not rolling blind. You can sense the motion of the waves. You can time the next attempt to make it as easy as possible. Rolling your kayak is like a dance with the waves. It's all about rhythm, timing, and understanding your partner, the water. Does this make sense? Does this look more comfortable? If yes, what you want to do next is learn to move your pelvis in a way that allows you to get this kind of rotation. I'll show you what else this will unlock for you in a moment, but first I want to offer you something. To really get a handle on this, you'll need more than a quick tip. That's why I'm offering you a free video series to help you master the art of rolling in rough water. In this series, you'll learn more techniques and drills to practice to make your roll second nature, even in the roughest of water. Click the link in the description below, sign up for the free video series, and take your first step towards mastering the roll today. It's a lot easier than you think. As you learn to move well with your kayak, you notice things get a whole lot easier. It's not just about a more reliable roll, it's about a much more effective low brace. It's about having a balanced brace. You find that capsizing now has a whole new meaning. It's not this scary thing that makes you feel out of control. It's more like a very stable position that allows you to relax, take a break, and evaluate your next move. Of course, rolling your kayak is now a non-issue. You wonder what the big deal ever was. If you want to learn this, make sure to sign up with the link in the description. Thanks for watching, and if you think this video could be valuable to others, please share it.